basement of Embora Studio. I'm just using water-based paints last month or so. Came to the Vortex, also known as Embora, um, about two years ago. They needed a sign painted on the glass, and then I started volunteering to work in exchange for classes, and then I um, started painting again. In one hand, they're just supposed to be movement studies. I'm always re-examining the human form and trying to find an honest but modern way to depict the modern form reconstructed. I feel like modern art was a lot about being honest about how imperfect and split we are as humans. This is a portrait of a woman who uh, is one of my fellow classmates in a martial arts class here at Embora. We have these sticks from the Philippines. This is our teacher, kind of, over here on the, on the right, um, Woza. And I still am moving him around. I'm not sure where he's going to land in the portrait, or in this double portrait. And then there's going to be these figures. Um, just showing the movement and the and some of the, the forms when you strike with the sticks that are going to be smaller and depicted around the bottom. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be 20 again for nothing. I was freaking out. Uh, I was living in California. It was a beautiful place. I was gardening. I was eating fruit off the trees. I was backpacking. I was um, really... I, I, had, I was blessed to have the chance to immerse myself in, in, the, in a natural environment. And uh, that was a good break from New York City. Learn to trust your own instincts. Learn to uh, really listen to what, partly what your, your body is telling you in the holistic sense of the, the mind, body, and spirit being connected. You'll have parents and a lot of well-meaning people just you know, cautioning you that you should take a safer route and you should do something more sensible. And, um, you know, you have to be kind to people, but, but there's got to be some way to preserve yourself and quiet and shut everything off and really just follow your instincts. And look at art. Look at art every, every day.